Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how I organize my skincare, my hair care, my fragrances, and all that good stuff. So if you're into organization videos, nice and clean, you know the deal. Just keep watching because that's exactly what this video is going to be. So these three drawers are basically the only three drawers we have in our bathroom. This is like a big cabinet for under the sink. And then this is like the most worst way to design a drawer because it's so unorganized. Like you can hardly organize any product in here. But basically the top two drawers are mine. And this is how I organize my shit in a very small two bedroom, two bathroom condo. These are the two drawers I get and the last one is my husband's, which is not organized whatsoever. But here we just have um, some washed uh, washcloths for after we wash our face. And then here we have like our Q-tips, which I definitely need to refill. But let's start off with the first drawer. So the first drawer is pretty organized. I mean, I don't think it could get any more organized with the amount of space I have. If you guys have more space, then it will look more organized. If I had more space, it would definitely be way more organized. But basically over here, if we start on the left, I have like a skincare headband to keep my hair out of the way when I wash my face or when I do my makeup. Here I have hair elastics. I usually have way more. Um, I think that they're just in my random drunk, uh, junk drawer in the kitchen, but I usually have like, this is usually like pretty much overflowing. Here are my beauty blenders. This one needs to be washed obviously, but this is where I keep my beauty blenders when I do decide to wear makeup. Here are two, um, what are these, Laneige, Laneige. Uh, sleeping water masks these you can get at winners for literally like $12 each that's what I got mine instead of Sephora for I think like double the price but I do have two this one is completely full I'm almost out of this one so I did pick this one up and then here we do have some floss I put the floss here because I need to remember to floss more I hardly ever floss it definitely has helped me here we have lip balms. Um, I'm so glad that I actually organized this drawer because it makes me realize how much stuff I have. When I put lip balms here, I literally have lip balm to last me ages. I have more too in my car. Over here, we have cleansing water. I like to use this before I dermaplane, which is like once every three weeks. But I have two types. This is more for when I have like eye, stubborn eye makeup. This I just use if I like literally have no time to wash my face in the morning when I'm with my son. So I just use this. Here I have waterproof micellar water. This one is definitely oily. So I don't like wash my face with this. I just, I take my makeup off with this when I have like waterproof mascara on. Over here we have um, face masks. I did buy these face masks from Amazon, amazon.ca. They are absolutely amazing. I was not expecting them to be that nice. I should have, um, here, I do have two little, I think these are called like eye pads. If you throw them in the freezer and put them on your eyes, it really helps with like depuffing your eyes. Um, I don't know why my eye masks are here. I think my husband decided that he wanted to have a spa night. But these are the under eye masks I use. Under eye, yeah, under eye masks. The Grace and Stella. These you can get off Amazon for like super affordable. They're really nice. They're really hydrating. I like to use this like at least three times a week. It's just really nice at night. Here I have the Basia. Um, luminizing pink mask this one's almost empty i did get this at winners for like super cheap instead of sephora winners has great deals here we just keep my cotton pads cotton rounds in 
this drawer we have our um, facial oil I use this facial oil when I dermaplane if I'm not dermaplaning I don't use facial oil because I already have really oily skin but this drawer basically is like extra facial cleansers and exfoliants and some like facial tools so here's the fenty skin and the travel size i really like this cleanser it's amazing for oily skin here we have the kylie skin exfoliator the eye cream from kylie skin this one kind of burns when you put it under your eye let me know if anyone else experiences that, but mine definitely burns. And then here I have my gua sha, which I use when I have time and when I'm not lazy. But I have my like glass gua sha. And then I have my, oh my goodness. I have my rose, I don't know, like rose quartz. Um, facial roller i do like to use this when i moisturize at night and then this is the dermaplaning tool i use um i have no idea what the brand of this is but it's super good love it gets all the peach buds here we have some whitening strips let's just flip this around so that you guys can see here we have whitening strips. These ones are off Amazon.ca. Super good for sensitive teeth. And this is the first drawer. Oh yeah, and then I have my hairbrush. This is a new hairbrush. This is the wet brush. One of the best hairbrushes in my opinion, especially if you have really thick curly hair. It helps with breakage. But this is my first drawer. This is like, I know other people have like an oral drawer, a like mask drawer a i don't know like facial drawer but i have to put everything in one drawer i literally have no room to put other things and i guess it, it works for me it's completely fine on to the second drawer which is like my hygiene drawer kind of this is like everything like scents deodorant creams and a little bit of hair care but in this side, we have my scents. This is the uh, Body Shop Pomegranate and Red Berries um, Hair and Body Mist. This is really nice for when I put dry shampoo in my hair and I just need it to like smell nice. I have the Daisy Marc Jacobs and then the, um, the Miss Dior perfume. I'm not sure what kind this is, but I love it. Um, over here, we just have some body spray from Bath and Body Works. And here is my epilator for when I'm not scared to use it. Um, I am doing laser hair removal right now, so I don't use that actually very often. But in this, we have some hair care, which is just this heat protectant and this Amica uh, pre-shampoo color seal, which I definitely need to use. Here we just have like tools. Um, we have like an eyebrow trimmer and just some tweezers. I feel like I always lose my tweezers, so I definitely needed a spot in my drawer for this. Here we have my deodorant. Here we have more um, body sprays. I use this spray at night. This is like my night scent. It's super light vanilla. Vanilla? Oh no, lavender. It smells like vanilla, but I guess it's lavender. Um, here we have my Olaplex products. I really don't use my Olaplex products a lot. I mean, I only wash my hair once a week, but I do have these here for when I just, my hair is feeling really damaged. My hair is damaged because I used to be really blonde and I did go back to black. So I definitely have these products here to help my hair um, repair. Here I have bonding oil. I have two of them. My husband does use this too for his hair. And then this is another hair oil. This is the... I don't know, just like a random oil for when I don't want to use something fancy. But then here, we just have like kind of some extra random products. I just have another micellar water because my other one is running out. This by far is my favorite, the one with um, rose water. This is tea tree oil. I use this as a toner. I always get the um, cucumber scent. 
if you guys didn't know after you get out of the shower if you uh, wet a cotton round and wipe it between your butt cheeks it keeps you smelling fresh all day like it's absolutely amazing this or like wipe it under your armpits for when you're just having a sweaty day this will stop you from smelling it is absolutely amazing um this here is like my hip and my bum um moisturizer it was uh, i got it during the sephora sale but it's just like the frank body but first coffee it's so far pretty good um i definitely don't think it plumps your bum but i do like the smell of coffee so that's why i got that here i have some of my face creams i would keep my face cream up here but i have absolutely no room so i do keep it down here this is just the garnier um gel cream i do have oily skin so i love using a gel moisturizer i just feel like it's so much more lightweight and moisturizing in my opinion and then here i have the pharmacy um what is this daily greens oil free gel moisturizer this was like 60 dollars, and i personally don't think it was worth it um let me know in the comments if you guys think this was worth it but i definitely didn't think it was at all but it was nice to try it out but yeah these are basically my drawers that i spent very long organizing but yeah if you guys want more organizing videos on how i organize my um son's room or just other parts of my bathroom maybe underneath my sink please let me know and don't forget to subscribe bye guys